Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing great and staying safe in this corona times. This is the first video of me in this particular year. So happy new year to every one of you watching this video. All the best to the people who are planning to appear in the IELTS exam in this year. This video is about the writing topics that you can expect in the coming IELTS examination and I'll be talking specifically about writing task 2 that is the essays and it, the topics are going to be same for the academic and as well as general candidates the only difference basically is in the task 1 yes it might be possible that the academic candidates get a different question for write ta writing task 2 and the general might get different they won't get similar or quite possible they might even get similar the question remains the same right there are no different questions in terms of task 2 for academic or general like i cannot say that you know all together have different kind of questions on writing task 2 because it's just an essay and you can get any kind of essay so in this particular video what i've done is i've compiled 100 different questions like i've been doing for the last two quarters and i've got such a nice response from my audience i have you know send the pdf to almost like hundreds of students from all parts of the world and i've received their love thank you so much for that love and showing interest and even before i'm recording this video i have started getting queries for this january to april 2022 session for the questions so i'm extremely sorry for being late but yes it does take time to compile such kind of questions to decide what to keep and what to eliminate to see what kind of questions are repeated and what kind of questions have been coming in the examination so in this 100 pdf questions you are going to find questions related to education questions related to children say like um, tourism traveling and pollution and the sports celebrities well, there are different kind of questions on this they are not in order i am not saying that i have kept a different category for each but they yes they are mixed kind of questions and what you can do is like i'm always saying you are going to get a question from this particular list but yes this particular list almost covers all kind of questions that you can fathom what you can do is you can start reading this question practicing this question you can generate your ideas so you will almost cover every kind of horizon right i don't think so you will be left out with any kind of question so if you practice this hundred question i think you'll be more than ready for the examination to take down the examination apart from this uh when i send you the pdf there will be something interesting there will be a surprise for you in that pdf as well I have made so many different videos on speaking and writing plus I have come up with different English vocabularies in my playlist so you can go and check those playlists as well and they are going to help you greatly. If anyone is looking forward to get this video please you can write me down at my email that is in the on the screen right now that is ielswitharun at the rate gmail.com I'll be more than happy to send you the PDF in, if anyone is facing you facing any kind of trouble in any of the four modules that is the writing reading speaking or listening please feel free to write me down on my email or you can comment on the comment section please watch this video till the last the important topics in it if you like this video click like share with your other friends and if you have any kind of suggestion please write me down in the comment section apart from this i'm also having my instagram handle where i'm trying to post things regularly which are very helpful that is by the name www instagram.com slash ielts with arun please follow that channel i know keep coming back regularly and share the videos with your friends so let's not waste more time and go to the video let's start many people today do not feel safe either at home or when they are out what are the causes what are the solutions next information technology is changing many aspects of our lives and now dominates our home, leisure and work activities. To what extent do the benefits of information technology outweigh the disadvantages? Next, some think increasing business and cultural contact between nations is positive. Others think it leads to the disappearance of the national identity. Discuss both views and state your opinion. Next. Some people think that schools should select students according to their academic abilities, while others believe that it is better to have students with different abilities studying together. Discuss both views and state your opinion. Next, many, job require, many jobs require online training and research to stay competitive in a world with rapidly evolving information and technology. Some believe 
that it is the responsibility of businesses to pay for this training for their staff while others feel it is up to the individual. Discuss both views and give your opinion. Next, there is too much noise in public places in cities. What are the causes of this problem? What can be done to solve the problem? Next, nowadays many families are rarely having meals together. Why is this happening? Is this a positive or a negative development? Next, many doctors recommend that older people exercise regularly but most patients do not follow any exercise routine. Why do you think it is happening? How can people be encouraged to exercise regularly? Next, some people say that high school students should study all the school subjects while others think they should be allowed to choose subjects that they love or are a good at. Discuss both views and give your opinion. Next, some people believe that students should acquire working experience during their gap year instead of traveling. Do you agree or disagree with the statement? Give your opinion and include relevant examples. Today, different kinds of advertising influence our life. Do the negative effects of this development outweigh the positive? Next, young people who commit crimes should be punished in the same way as adults. Do you agree or disagree with this statement? Some people say that school leavers should start working immediately. Others say that they should continue their studies at university. Discuss both views and give your opinion. Next, nowadays, a lot of offices employ open space designs instead of separate rooms for work. Do the advantages of this outweigh the disadvantages? Next, Scientific research should be carried out and controlled by the governments rather than private companies. To what extent do you agree or disagree? This question is repeated many times. Next, some people think that children should begin their formal education at a very early age. Others think they should begin after 7 years of age. Discuss both views and give your opinion. Next. Many believe that it is important to protect all wild animals, while others think that it is important to protect some, not all of them. Discuss both views and give your opinion. Next, recent research suggests that the majority of criminals who are sent to the prison commit crimes after they are released. Why is this the case? What can be done to solve the problem? Next, the tendency of human beings to copy one another is shown in the popularity of areas such as fashion and consumer goods. To what extent do you agree? Next, living in a country where you have to speak a foreign language can cause serious problems as well as practical problems. To what extent do you agree or disagree with this statement? Give reasons for your answer and include any relevant examples from your own knowledge or experience. Next, Some people work for the same organization all their working life. Others think it is better to work for different organizations. Discuss both views and give your opinion. Next, exposure to international media such as films, TV and magazines has an impact on the local culture. What do you think of this impacts? Do you think that the advantages of this impact? Facts outweigh the disadvantages. Give reasons for your answer and include any relevant examples from your own knowledge or experience. Next, some people suggest that regular driving tests should be taken by people to reduce the number of accidents throughout their lives rather than one single test. What do you think are the disadvantages of repeat driving tests? Do this outweigh the disadvantages? Next, some people believe that studying online is more effective than studying on campus while others disagree. Discuss both views and give your opinion. Which one do you think is most effective? This is an important question considering the present scenario. Next question. In some countries, more and more people are becoming interested in finding out about the history of house or building they live in. What are the reasons for this? How can people research this? Next. In the future, it seems it will be more difficult to live on the earth some people think that more money should be spent on researching other planets to live. 
such as Mars. To what extent do you agree or disagree? Give reasons for your answer and include any relevant examples from your own knowledge or experience. Next. Some people think parents should supervise their children's activities closely, while others believe children should have more freedom. Discuss. Some people suggest that bringing up children by the whole family, including uncles, aunts and grandparents is better rather than only by parents. Do you agree or disagree with this statement? Give your opinion and examples. Next. Children nowadays spend a great deal of time watching television. However, television cannot replace the books as a learning tool, which is why children are less well educated today. To what extent do you agree with this statement? Next. Since most information about culture and history can be found on the internet, museums are not needed anymore. To what extent do you agree? Let's just scroll down so there's so many questions. Say like for example, this is one on sport. In order to be successful at a sport, some think you must be physically strong while others believe mental strength is more important. Discuss both views and give your opinion. Say like... There are more questions on children and government as you can see like there is one on shopping also. Shopping habits depend more on your age, group than anything else. To what extent do you agree or disagree? Hey people, I had to pause this video all of a sudden because as you can see there are so many questions uh, that are still to cover and if I keep on dictating all these questions in this particular video, the length of the video is going to increase a lot and uh, some of you might not like to want it so i'm cutting down over here and i'm telling you if anyone wants this video please uh, send me an email at alswitharun at the gmail.com just stating that you want this pdf i'll be more than happy to send you this video apart from this i'm having an instagram handle by the name www.instagram.com slash alswitharun Follow the channel and keep coming back because I'm posting interesting stuff related to English, your different kind of skills, it will help you greatly. So till then, all the best for your arts examination, stay safe in this corona times. I'll be back again with another video. Thank you so much.